Tadam! I know a lot of you are waiting for this comparison. I am a brewista. I am an admitted brewista user from day one. Um, I have two different artisan kettles and I have one Brewista X kettle. <laughs> this is my first kettle that is not Brewista and it actually surprised me. Um, if you want to see that video, I will put the link here. This is the Kappa CWK100. I was very impressed by this kettle that I want to actually put it head to head with a Brewista. The Brewista kettle, if you're not very familiar with it, if you're not very familiar with the channel, the Brewista kettle is one of, one of the most um, famous kettles in pour over industry. In filter coffee, um, it is being used worldwide and it is almost always the choice of champions in the world stage. By saying that I am willing to compare the Kappa CWK100 to my Brewista Artisan Kettle says a lot. In the first video, I actually made a measurement of the spout because the spout is what really got me. The size of the spout in comparison to its body having a one liter capacity is very rare. You don't always find that combination, all right? So the one liter Brewista has a bigger spout as well. The Hario, the Hario Bono kettle, the one liter variant has a bigger spout as well. Um, I think the only other exception is the Fellow Stag. Yeah, so the Fellow Stag is the other kettle that has a one liter capacity but a very nice spout. But I don't have a Fellow Stag, so I can't compare it with a Fellow Stag. Unless someone from the viewers might want to lend me your Fellow Stag. <laughs> Kidding aside, for today's video, I'm gonna show you some of the physical aspects and some of the heating qualities and performance of both the kettles. Right. I think I want to start with how it sounds, the volume of the sound that it produces while heating up your water, and how fast. We're gonna measure maybe 300 ml. 300 ml is what I normally use when I brew my coffee because I normally brew around 15 grams. Kappa first. Let's put up the kappa first. Yeah, so this is a Time More thermometer. It's, it's an actual <laughs> coffee use thermometer. We can't test for boil because the Brewista has a flash boil um, feature where it ramps up power to quickly boil the water. So we can't set it to that. Maybe we can test for um, around 92 degrees. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do 92 degrees. All right. I'm gonna set it now to 92. Right, I've started my timer and I've set it, I've set the kettle to 92 degrees. Wow, we finished one minute and four seconds. Okay, now we're gonna do the Brewista. We have 300 ml and then clear. I'm gonna turn this on. Set it to 92. Keep warm. There is a delay with the Brewista before it starts, so it will count maybe three or four counts before it starts heating up your water. And the temperature is climbing now. This is how it sounds.
It's at 58 degrees now. Okay, whoa, it took a lot longer. We finished that with the brewista at one minute and 30 seconds. Wow, that is surprising. The, the difference right now obviously is the sound that it makes. If you want to hear that again, I'm gonna play it right now. Okay, now we're gonna check the the temperature so remember I pressed the keep warm on the um, kappa so I of course I assume that it's maintaining its heat the kappa reheated the water now we're gonna check the temperature okay so the temperature is actually 92 Okay, let's check the brewista. Okay, and the brewista is 92 as well. We have um, temperature accuracy on both of the kettles. But yeah, I think for now, that's it. That's the comparison that I'm gonna make. Um, we're gonna do another comparison. Um, I can't do the physical comparisons right now because I'm gonna need to do another setup for that, another setup of camera for that. Because of course, I wanna do it simultaneous while talking to you. I'm gonna put a new camera here so that you can see actually how it moves on the base, how big the base is occupying and all that. But yeah, for now, that's it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed watching. Um, Thank you. In the next videos, I'm gonna show you more about coffee. Bye!